I'm gonna be showing you how to make my peanut butter and blackberry jelly baked oatmeal cake. The first thing we're gonna have to do with this recipe is I'm gonna make what's called a slurry. A slurry is just a watery mixture that helps bind together other ingredients. And I love using chia seeds to make a slurry. We start with one tablespoon of water and one tablespoon of chia seeds. And that one to one ratio is typically enough to replace one egg in most of your recipes. So what you're gonna do is you have the chia seeds in your water, you're gonna take it and you're just gonna stir it. This, take, this takes a little bit of time. All right, you see this right here? This is the texture that we're going for. It should just kind of glob off the spoon. Set that aside for right now. Grab a big mixing bowl, and we're gonna start with our oats. I'm gonna grab two cups of these gluten-free oats by Bob's Red Mill. One and a half cups of coconut milk. You can use any non-dairy milk that you like. I got a half cup of peanut butter right here. Just glob that on top. A quarter teaspoon of baking powder. Quarter teaspoon of cinnamon. And also we got our one and a half tablespoons of coconut oil. Just a pinch of salt right on top. Now I'm gonna add in that chia seed slurry that I was making earlier. Just gonna help thicken up the recipe. Now, that is all the sweetness you're gonna need. You see, I don't add any other sugar to this recipe. It's all gonna come from this natural fruit sweetener, this blackberry jelly that we made earlier. So we're gonna add about three quarters of a cup. Now we're just gonna mix this all together and distribute it evenly before we're gonna add it to a pan and then we're gonna start cooking it. Maybe it's love, maybe it's us, maybe it's everybody. Get about a 10 by 10 inch baking pan. And you know, we got a little bit of this coconut oil left over from before. So we just want to drizzle that on top. And you know, you can use your hands, spread that out. All right, just glop it on. Spread it out. Because we're gonna treat ourselves today. We're gonna add one, we're gonna add two, we're gonna add three spoonfuls right there. Now I got my convection oven over here preheated to 350 degrees. So we're gonna cook this in the oven for 350 degrees for 30 minutes. We started out with our blackberry jelly and out came this amazing cake. Really looking forward to you guys trying that. Thanks for checking out one of my favorite segments from Trying Vegan with Mario. To watch full episodes, check your channel guide and see if I'm playing in your area. My full episodes are also streaming on Roku. It's me, Mario. <laughs> <laughs> Trying Vegan with Mario. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. A thumbs up.